and today we are going to solve the type of triangles problem of SQL in HackerRank. So let's see what is this problem about. So we have to write a query identifying the type of each record in the triangles using the three side lengths. So basically we have a table which consists of three sides A, B and C and we have to compare those sides to get an output either equilateral or isosceles or scalene or not a triangle. So basically when the sides of the triangle when all the sides of a triangle are equal then it's then it is said to be an equilateral triangle and when the sides when either of the two sides are equal then it is said to be an isosceles if none of the sides are equal then it's said to be an scale and triangle and if you're not able to form a triangle with the help of three sides then it is said to be not a triangle obviously we cannot form a triangle so output should be not a triangle so what is the necessary condition uh, for forming a triangle with three sides? So the necessary condition for forming a triangle with three sides is that the sum of two sides should be greater than the third side. Okay, so I'm going to use the case statements for this code. Case statements are same as if and else statements for any other languages. So if you are familiar with if and else statements and if you, are, if you know how the syntax goes, then it is going to be very easy for you. So let's head towards the code and start the solution. So this is select case. Firstly, I'm going to check if we are able to form a triangle or not. So that is sum of two sides should be greater than the third side. A plus B should be greater than C and B plus C should be greater than A and A plus C should be greater than B if this condition is satisfied then we will further move to the conditions for equilateral isosceles and scalene so that is the inner case when so we are going to check for the equilateral now when a is equals to b and b is equals to c and c is equals to a if this condition holds then the output should be equilateral now for isosceles either of the two sides should be equal a is equals to b and b is equals to c sorry we will use or because we need either of the two statement either of the two sides and C is equals to A. If this condition holds, then the output should be isosceles. And if these two conditions are not satisfied, then the third alternative is scalene. So else scalene. And we will end this here. Now this is the end for the inner case. There is a outer case also. For that we have to mention the else part. And the else part is not a triangle. So then end, then from table name, and then we hit the submit code. So we are done with the code. I hope you enjoyed this video, and that's the end of the tutorial. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up and do hit the subscribe button and turn on the bell icon to get notification for the latest videos. I would really appreciate it. If you have any query, you can mention it down in the comment section. Also, please do share the video with your friends or with anyone who is in need. Let's spread the knowledge together. Thank you.